locals are beginning to stock up on necessities and hunker down once again. News 11's Arlette Youssef has more on the so-called panic buying and a look at store shelves. If you've been to Sam's Club recently, you've probably noticed the limit one sign above cases of water. One Sam's Club employee said the shelves were empty just a day before restocking. Costco is also re-implementing purchase limits. At the height of the pandemic last year, toilet paper was the highest in demand. One shopper says not again. I think they're getting paranoid again. I'm not going to do it this time. <laughs> there was a ration last time and people had excessive amount of items and didn't leave any for the everyday people, so I'm not doing it. She's not the only one who thinks it shouldn't happen. I just think it's ridiculous what people do like that. It just hurts that person, you know, greedy. Some say it is okay to stock up, just not excessively. I believe it's okay to prepare yourself with water, but not with a lot of toilet paper. I think there are other important priorities. People need to just, I mean, they need to take caution, but they need to, they need not to go overboard about it. Some people haven't even used the items they bought at the beginning of the pandemic. I have like lots of beans, lots of rice, and it's just too much. I'm, I'm starting to give it away already. Although there are supply concerns, shelves at Walmart seem to be maintaining some products, even with some empty spaces. <laughs> Reporting in Yuma, Arlette Youssef, News 11, 